Jana Duggar really surprised everyone as soon as she made her comeback in the social media world. After all that her family went through since Josh Duggar's scandals, Duggar News followers knew that she was on a break. But when she came back from her hiatus, she brought along a lot of surprises. One of them was a tour of her tiny fixer-upper one bit home. Then Jana also hinted at her engagement when viewers spotted a huge ring on her finger. But without confirming anything, she instantly shared pictures of her wedding, which was merely a few weeks later. She got back together with her old boyfriend, Stephen Wisman, and they tied the knot. Now the couple is dedicated to building their new home together. They recently showed off some renovations from their kitchen, take a look. Just like most of her siblings, Jana Duggar also lived most of her life in Arkansas. She stayed at her parents' compound as she didn't decide to marry young. Duggar News followers know she got her happily ever after at 34 when she finally tied the knot in August 25th with Stephen Wisman at a grand wedding with over 500 guests. Since then, Jana has gone through a lot of changes. Jana and Stephen are now living in Arkansas. Both of them are ready to build their lives together. She has used her YouTube vlogs to flaunt the fixer-upper mansion they are currently renovating. Both of their families step in to help around. Jana had once recorded her father and brother sending her material from Arkansas to Nebraska for the revamp, and fans are eager to see how they will pull the project off. Longtime Duggar News followers must know that Jim Bob comes from the real estate field, and many of his kids are contractors. Hence, it's quite common for the Duggars to be good at revamping properties. While well, Jana is also one of them, it looks like her husband, Stephen Wisman, also has experience in this department. So, in her new YouTube video, she captured this journey. As Jana and Stephen are trying to make their fixer-upper home habitual, they are in the middle of giving it a new look. They worked on their kitchen from scratch. In the video, the couple installed cabinets together and showed off their make-do substitute kitchen with minimal utensils until the final one got ready. Jana happily spoke about being in her element. That's because broadening her skills and picking up challenges like these would help her in feeling so. She feels all the hard work is going to be extra rewarding as it is indeed special that the star and Steven are building their house together. Viewers also agreed to this and complimented the ST. It was easier for the couple to finish renovating their house because Steven had done commercial painting jobs in the past and being skilled at spraying. His family would also step in to work once in a while to increase productivity. Keep an eye on TV season and spoilers for more Duggar news updates. Jana Wisman Nay Duggar shared a before and after look into the brand new kitchen in her home with husband Stephen Wisman amid their renovation process. The Counting on Alum 34 gave fans an inside look at her completing the remodel in a YouTube video posted on October 20th. The video which was filmed before she and Stephen 31 Wet in August began with Jana explaining that she was redoing the windowsills in the kitchen. After she got the windowsills in place, Jana showed off what the kitchen looked like in the early stages of the renovation. She revealed that the kitchen was missing appliances and the cabinetry wasn't usable, and she explained that they had to place all of their appliances on one table and wash their dishes in the bathroom sink. The clip continued with Jana filling in big gaps above the cabinets with wood filler as she explained why she enjoyed renovating her house. They say do what you love and you'll never work a day in your life. It is so true, she said. When I'm working on projects like this, I really feel like I'm in my element. I love the challenge of broadening my skill set and figuring out how to do new things. All the work and effort feels extra rewarding this time because this is going to be the home Steven and I will live in together once we're married, Jana continued. It doesn't get any better than that. When it came to painting the kitchen beige, Jana explained that Stephen's experience from his past commercial painting jobs made the process easier. She also shared that his parents were on hand amid the renovation, adding that having those extra hands really helped to speed up the process. Once the drawers and cabinets were painted, Jana unveiled the modern and simple gold hardware she planned to put on the drawers. Putting in a whole new kitchen has definitely been a huge undertaking, especially since we've been doing so much of the work ourselves with the help of family and friends. But it's so rewarding to see this project coming together, she said about the process. I imagine it will be so much more meaningful to use this space in the years to come remembering all the hard work and elbow grease we put into making this space what it is. Also shared her hopes for once the renovation was complete, saying that she was really looking forward to decorating this and turning this into a home. The TLC alum continued, 
I just want everything to feel cozy and inviting. I'm really looking forward to that part of the project. I can hardly wait to see how it all comes together. Jana shared the video. Many fans took to the comments section to applaud her and Steven for their hard work. You have done so well with your home remodel. I'm so happy you found someone to work with you as a teammate. Congratulations on everything, one person wrote. Another chimed in, renovating your house before the wedding sounds like the ideal way to get ready for marriage. I hope you two have many years of joy together. Obi Duggar and Michelle Duggar's eldest daughter shocked fans when she married Stephen following a secret courtship. After their wedding, Jana moved from Arkansas to Nebraska to live with her husband. She reflected on the big move in a YouTube video posted on October 9th, admitting she was gonna miss being close to family. Right now while I'm back in Arkansas, it makes me really want to be intentional and to make some fun memories with my family and soak up these final weeks here, Jana added in the video which was filmed before their wedding. The Counting On star brought her fans along as she and her husband Stephen Wisman installed cabinets, drawers, countertops and hardware in the space Jana Duggar is showing off her brand new kitchen. The Counting On star 34 offered an inside look at the process of installing all the finishing touches in her kitchen that she's been remodeling with her new husband, Stephen Wisman, in a YouTube video shared on Sunday, October 20th. She kicks off the update by showing footage that was filmed before she tied the knot with Wisman this past August, including the cabinetry that's just starting to take shape, and explains how their current makeshift kitchen works. So, since our kitchen looks like this, she says as she pans the camera around the empty space, this becomes our kitchen. She lands on their temporary setup that's equipped with a griddle, coffee maker, and utensils. Cooking my food here and we end up washing all the dishes in here, she adds, making her way into the bathroom where she washes and dries everything. So ready to have an actual working kitchen again. Hopefully we'll get it done within a week or so. The video then cuts to her filling in big gaps above the cabinets with wood filler as she opens up about the renovation process. They say do what you love and you'll never work a day in your life. It is so true. When I'm working on projects like this I really feel like I'm in my element. I love the challenge of broadening my skill set and figuring out how to do new things. She continues, all the work and effort feels extra rewarding this time because this is going to be the home Steven and I will live in together once we're married. It doesn't get any better than that. Before painting the cabinets, Duggar explains how her now husband has done commercial painting jobs in the past, so he's skilled at using a sprayer. She also notes how his parents came over to assist them and that having those extra hands really helped to speed up the process. The perfect color they picked out, Duggar previously noted, was accessible beige. Once the drawers and cabinets are all painted, Duggar and her husband get to work installing them in the empty spaces. I think we make a great team, she captioned the clip in white text, followed by a pink heart emoji. The countertops arrive and get secured in place, and Duggar unveils the modern and simple gold hardware she's going to put on the drawers. She then reflected on how arduous the process of renovating a home is, but how it's going to be worth it in the long run. Putting in a whole new kitchen has definitely been a huge undertaking, especially since we've been doing so much of the work ourselves with the help of family and friends. But it's so rewarding to see this project coming together, she says. I imagine it will be so much more meaningful to use this space in the years to come remembering all the hard work and elbow grease we put into making this space what it is. The newlywed also added, I am really looking forward to decorating this and turning this into a home. I just want everything to feel cozy and inviting. I'm really looking forward to that part of the project. I can hardly wait to see how it all comes together. Duggar, who is the eldest daughter of Jim Bob and Michelle Duggar's 19 children, first revealed to people that she was relocating to Wisman's hometown in Nebraska from her native Arkansas after the pair wed in August. He has a little house we bought that we've been fixing up and getting pulled together, and so that's been fun she told people at the time. Jana has since been sharing an inside look at the renovation projects she's been working on alongside her husband, dad and siblings, including some of the unexpected challenges they've encountered in the process. Joanna Forsyth Nay Duggar, known from her childhood on TLC's 19 Kids and Counting, now has a family of her own with her husband Austin Forsyth and their three children Gideon, Evelyn and Gunnar. Recently, she spoke candidly about her. Joyanna revealed that after giving birth to her youngest child, Gunnar, she faced one of the hardest periods of her life. It was like the darkest time of my life she shared emotionally. 
Her struggle with postpartum depression wasn't new she described similar feelings after her first child, Gideon, but noted that it was most intense after Gunner's birth. She recalled feeling in a fog for six months after Gideon was born, and while her experience after Evelyn's birth was milder, she still faced challenges. The severity of her postpartum depression after Gunner, she believes, stemmed from not taking proper care of herself during her pregnancy. I wasn't getting the right food, vitamins, or rest, Joanna admitted. Beyond physical changes, she also faced relational and spiritual struggles as her siblings, Jinger Duggar Vualo and Jill Duggar Dillard, published books that led her to question her upbringing and faith. Initially, Joanna felt fine post-birth, but two and a half months later, everything changed. She said, I would wish that on no mom, but I know a lot of moms go through it. For months, she struggled to get out of bed and manage daily responsibilities, feeling overwhelmed by spiritual doubts. Despite the struggle, she decided to seek help. I finally got to a point where I was like, I'm not doing good. I'm struggling, she shared. Her doctor suggested medication, but Joanna chose to start with prescription strength vitamins after blood work indicated a deficiency. With support from her husband, who prepared meals and ensured she had proper nutrition, she began making lifestyle changes. Recognizing the importance of mental health, Joanna also decided to stop breastfeeding Gunner for her well-being. At six months postpartum, I knew it was better for my mental health to stop. The change, along with healthier eating and physical activity, led to a significant improvement. Joanna also found strength through connection, seeking guidance from a Christian counselor, and bonding with other moms facing similar struggles. A fellow mom at her church encouraged her to seek help, which she now wishes she had done sooner. Reflecting on her journey, Joanna shared, I was fighting for months to feel better, but I wouldn't change that season for anything. I've grown so much, 